Hello, everyone. So if I ask you, do you know the difference between a dollar asterisk and a dollar at the rate in terms of variable passing? Even if you don't know, let's see in the further section. So both dollar asterisk and dollar at the rate, it's used to get hold of what all positional parameters you pass through a script. If you remember properly, in the previous few questions, we discussed how we can get a hold of all those variables and how we can use inside a script. But these variables actually hold all those stuff. But there's a basic difference. If you provide dollar asterisk along with your script, then it considered as a single word. But if you use a dollar at the rate, it keep each and every parameter as a separate entity. Still confused? So let's try to find it with a script. Not a simple script. Don't get confused much. Simply what we are doing, whatever we are going to provide in our CLI along with the script execution, it's just holding those. So firstly, the first uh, for loop is just reading all the statements or whatever parameters you've given with the script and just printing it on the screen with a count number. Similarly, the same goes for dollar at the rate. And if you see the execution, now just a simple script, the script and whatever text you want to print. The dollar asterisk is actually providing that in the first parameter only, the complete string is being captured. But if you read the dollar at the rate variable output, you would notice that now it has captured the complete string in different, different variable or different parameters, you would say. So there's a basic difference between those, but eventually both are going to hold whatever parameters you have provided along with your script. I hope that's helpful. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.